Fanning is an easy way to create interesting looks by spreading values across a range of fixtures. This video demonstrates how to use fanning and light key for different kinds of fixture properties. Fanning can be applied to many kinds of fixture properties, for example, dimmer, color, iris, or pan angles. Let's begin by fanning the colors for these moving heads. The fanning HUD shows all fixtures which take part in fanning. The first thing to do is define the order of the fixtures. Most of the time, it makes sense to order fixtures by their position in the preview. In some cases, you may want to sort them by their short name or DMX address. Click the first and last fixture to change the start and end color. Light key allows fanning between more than two values. We can click any fixture to define its color. The blue dots indicate that we have defined a color for these fixtures. The color for the fixtures in between are calculated automatically. To remove a color, click the blue dot. Click outside the HUD to close it. The icon in the design view indicates that the color property is controlled by fanning. You can edit the fanning settings at any time. Just click the icon or press Shift-C to select the color property. You can think of fanning as a special value for a fixture property. Like any other value, it can be stored in presets and remains editable all the time. To remove fanning, select the fixtures and clear the color property. Fanning is often used for the positions of moving lights. Select the position property and add fanning. We can choose whether the pan angles, tilt angles, or both should be fanned. We want to fan only the pan angle, so all fixtures have the same tilt. This look slightly resembles a Japanese hand fan, which is where the name fanning comes from. As before, we can click a fixture to change its position. And to find the positions of additional fixtures to create this asymmetrical effect. Fanning can also be applied to fixtures with multiple beams. This way, we can create a continuous color gradient across the LED matrices. The fixture order determines the orientation of the gradient. These options control whether fanning is applied to the individual beams or if all beams of each fixture should have the same color.